given us a function. So continuous random variable, they say show this function is a probability density function. When we deal with continuous random variable, so most of the time we will draw our interval so that we can view our function clearly. So for this question, it's a quite simple question. Just from 2 to 3 with a function here, 4 over 15x minus 1 cubed. So in order to show that it is a probability density function, so the characteristic here we must hold, which is the area, the total probability, which is the total area under the graph, must be equal to 1. So when we say area under the graph, it will come to integration. So for this area under the graph, we're going to integrate for value 2 up to 3 for this function. We have to calculate until we get 1. So once we get our value 1, means we can show this is a probability density function. Same meaning as showing this is a continuous random variable. So how to integrate this? When we do integration, so make sure our notation write it clearly. Integrate with respect to x. So we must write our dx. In integration, we are going to simplify first, where constant we can take up. Then we try to use our formula to solve our integration. We are going to integrate uh, using formula number 3, uh, which is power plus 1 over new power so divide the coefficient of x so inside here coefficient of x is 1 then write our upper limit and lower limit clearly then we just show out our step which is upper limit minus our lower limit so other than that we just press our calculator so this will give us exactly 1 so from here we can conclude out this function is a probability density function. So this working is same idea with proving this is continuous random variable.